Don't make a sound, user. What was that sound? A lost penny. It's my lucky day. Your lucky evening, my friend. Another penny. I'm going to be rich. You'll finally be able to pay your share of the rent. Another? There must be a leak. I hope you're not speaking of yourself, my dear friend. Stop cheating, for goodness sake! Holmes, I have the impression that there is whispering going on around us. A sort of voice with a Russian accent. But I'm not! There, did you hear it? The only thing I heard is the gentle rustling of the wind. With a Russian accent. Hmm. <sighs> you certainly have a thing for tinkering. That's not a good idea, user. No! Where are the monitor circuits? It looks like the set of the game, but seen from the other side. <laughs> I know what you're going to do. Don't you dare go help them out. User, you're really irritating. My Bartitsu techniques have gotten the better of this door. Come, Watson, let's go inside. Don't go with them! Mr. Wilhelm, are you there? It's far too dark in here. I can't be expected to walk around in the dark, Sherlock. So try to find us some light, Watson. These characters are trapped in the dark. We're lucky. Fixing a machine with a stamp. How logical. Just in case, I hope it's not connected to a light source. Where's the fake moon going? I hope it's not... Oh. Oh, I knew it! Well done, Watson. We can finally see better. I get the feeling that Mr. Wilhelm is redecorating. I don't recall him having a view of the moon. This place scares the living daylights out of me. Mr. Wilhelm, are you dead? Holmes, he's floating. Watson, what has he got on his face? Mr. Glitch, oh no. It looks like some sort of relatively thick monochromatic parasite. And it's serious? You're a disgrace to the medical profession. Let me take a closer look at it. I, for one, would rather keep my distance from that thing. Soul. It looks painful. Is it just me or did the red letter move? I can't stand hearing him scream. Finish him with your Bartitsu, Holmes. 
It's unbearable. How dare you steal from Mr. Wilhelm Scream? Put that edge back! You have no business with this letter H. If you were thinking about moving that fake wall, forget about it. The marks on the ground show that a piece of rail is missing. Or a letter of the other. Wait, did you just use a letter from an onomatopoeia to fix a rail? But that doesn't make any sense! You might as well use, I don't know, a monkey to work an hydraulic pump. It's dumb! But what really gets me is that it works! You just swiped their mining fine glass. The feast wasn't enough for you. I just hope they won't figure it out. I told you I had my magnifying glass in my hand, Watson, and it suddenly disappeared. There you go. They figure it out. That voice. It's the ghost, Holmes. The Russian ghost. But I'm not Russian. Mr. Wilhelm, you never told us you were such a talented ventriloquist. Oh, he's not the one speaking. I am. My name is Game. I'm a computer program. I'm with a user, a human. And we are trying everything we can to get home. Do you know how we can exit your game? Game? What game? Uh, your game. You are aware that the world you're in isn't real, don't you? <laughs> You don't know that you're in a video game, is that it? I'd rather look for my magnifying glass than continue listening to your mad jabbering, Mr. Wilhelm. But he's not the one... <clears throat> User, I think we're going to need Mr. Glitch's help. If he brought us into this dimension, he will probably be able to get us out of here. What's a video game? There's got to be a way to get it off. Maybe some kind of ritual? Unless, of course, you've got the number for the fire department. Nice zoom in, user. I knew that mining fine glass was a good idea. Well, this telephone chair is strange. It's like a mist puzzle. This device doesn't seem to be on. But if you like turning a wheel... What was that sound like a ringing bell? I think it came from this odd device. Oh, yes, Mr. Wilhelm told me about it. It's a prototype of Antonio Mucci's teletrophone. It allows you to communicate with another person from a distance instantly. I say, and how many of them exist? This is the only one of its kind. So it's useless. It's useless. Are you trying to make a phone call? You can see that it's much too small. Who are you going to call with this thing? We don't know anyone here. And he said it's the only one of its kind. works. There's a connection. That's strange. The teletrophone is making that odd noise again. Someone seems to be trying to communicate with us. It's the video ghost host. Come on, Watson, pull yourself together. It's probably Mr. Mucci who made a second one and is testing it. Mr. Sherlock Holmes speaking. A disenchantment ritual? You'll have to find another dupe, madam. Goodbye. 
Was it a video game? No, a telephone scam. User, this Sherlock Holmes fellow is not very cooperative. Hey, a big red ball, like a juicy cherry. There is something written on this strange hatch. Developers only. <laughs> One more rule you're going to be able to break. Uh, did the game crash? Echo! 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 Ah, I think I know where we are. It's a dictionary. This is where all the things that are used in the game are stored. A kind of hidden library. Only the developers can access this section. Hence the secret hatch, I suppose. You just plunged offerings in darkness, user. That's not very nice. Mind you, nothing you do even surprises me anymore. It's dark again over in this corner. I say, there's a bit of light over by the entrance. I may have lost my magnifying glass here. Well done, user. That character isn't by the communication device anymore. Good. We might finally be able to use this teletrophone in peace. I think you're going to have to answer, Mr. Watson. Holmes, the Russian video game is speaking to me. Pick up the phone, damn it! Very well. Are you a video game too? Yes. Three steps for a successful disenchantment? I'm listening. Ah, that's what we're interested in. There must be a full moon. Oh, as luck would have it, it's not the case. Cover the victim with snow? Uh, it's the middle of May. Then gently place a large cherry on top. Is this a ritual or a cake recipe? So, let me summarize. Full moon, snow, big cherry. Thank you, madam. We are screwed. And the award for Unscrewer of the Year goes to... The User! I voted for you. These cans of paint make me think of the three primary colors. 
Red, blue, and yellow. Except we're inside a cathode ray screen with a video signal, which is a mix of red, user, ice cream. Maybe it can be used as snow. After all, it's just water in a solid state. But how can we get it? Well done, Jim. All that's left is the cone. How can we fill it up with snow again? All we've got on hand is a game and a TV. No! TV snow! Uh, I'm impressed, user. Let's hope that this snow will do the trick. There you go. Sorry, Mr. Wilhelm. It's for your own good, I think. What a fantastic full moon. I hope the game won't get wise to us. Okay, we have all the ingredients. Why isn't anything happening? Look, it's starting! Watson, Mr. Wilhelm just exploded like a beached whale. Perhaps he was allergic to cherries. I'm finally free of that ridiculous pride. This trip has been more difficult than I imagined. Mr. Glitch! Game, you again? Did you follow me? We were transported here by accident. We? No, it can't be true. You brought the user with you. You're such a pain in the neck. And you wonder why she left you. I won't let you speak of her! Anyways, I have to go. This isn't the dimension I was aiming for. So, good game. <laughs> no! We have to follow him! But this painting just blocked the way! And I feel like it's backwards. Are you talking about your trousers, my good man? How are we going to get past it? Now the painting is the right way round. At least I think so. The passage is open again. Come, Holmes. Let's follow the rainbow ghost. Come then, Watson. It's probably just a large flying insect. So, if I understand right, some things seem to be affected by this bug fragment. It's like it reverses them or something. Uh, who cares? Let's follow them. Where is the exit? I can feel it here. Take us home. But why, game? You're not happy here with your new NPCs? NPC? Oh, they don't know that. Sorry, I meant new friends. Watson, stop conversing with this beast. You're making me uneasy. Their AI doesn't seem too great. Where are you trying to go, Mr. Glitch? To a place where I will be able to unleash my evil plan. What plan? The one that will let me... What? What did he say? A copy protection system right in the middle of a game? How barbaric! We're missing the explanation of his evil plan. Ah, let's find the numbers we need fast, user.
I wonder if it's related to that strange disc on the monitor. Do you think this copy protection system really existed? I doubt it was effective. On the other hand, it must have been good for the photocopier market. Say that again, we got cut off. No, there, I just saw the exit, which means this is where we say goodbye. Farewell, game. Enjoy your new cardboard home. Farewell, Rainbow Butterfly. He disappeared into the ground. How will we be able to follow him? Let's. Have a look around this street scenery. Oops. Oh, the ground isn't there anymore. But where did the characters go? There's the exit. Sherlock, I'm going to fall. Hold on, Watson. The world is ending. Everything is fake. I am fake. London is probably on a fault line. I'm going to get us out of this mess. Ah, darn it. We can't leave them there like that. Let's try to get them to safety quickly before leaving. <sighs> this manhole cover doesn't want to move. At least not from this side. for you. Go ahead, Mr. Holmes. Jump! Absolutely not. I don't see anything to land in on the other side. Obviously, that would have been too easy. You just spoke to the ghost, Holmes. Do you believe me now? Not at all. I was thinking out loud. on the other side. Jump! Hold on, Watson. We're going to swing over to the hole. Three, two, one. Well done, Holmes. What an extraordinary leap. This bathtub just saved our lives. I didn't see much because of the screen interference, but the jump animation must have been amazing. Okay, user. Now that they're safe, we can leave. Goodbye, gentlemen. We apologize for the inconvenience. Let's go! Legend of the Secret! Legend of the Secret? Ah, this still isn't our dimension. <clears throat> but you've been able to interact with the interface of this game? Uh, that will probably help us.
This looks a lot like an RPG. Oh, it's exactly the kind of game I was destined to become before I was uh, abandoned. Uh, let's start by waking up this character. That's what you always do in these games. Hero, wake up. Wake up! Wake up! Ah, he's... Oh, uh, but we've got to read. He's not even voiced. Uh, yes, yes, it's us. It's me. I'm not feeling well. Dimension all? User, that must be our way out. Yes, hero, that's it. Let's go rescue her. What? Uh, I say we go straight to the Dimensional Temple. We'll figure it out when we get there, okay? What is it? Then go find the key. It must be around here, somewhere. This one's not the sharpest knife in the drawer. Are all video game characters stupid then? Why are you looking at me? Where could he have put the key to the door? Are you the one who's making everyone jump, user? What have you done? Well, open it. Maybe the key's inside. Mr. Glitch has been here. And a key, especially a key. What happened? Did the glitchy hammer do this? Uh, I suspect that it shrinks the sprite it hits. Oh, I thought I saw the key behind the dresser. It's about time. Uh, go open the door now, hero. What now? Perfect. We can finally get on with the game. Uh, the quest, I mean. Anything sharp to get them with? The sword of life? Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. Uh, careful! <laughs> Did you not see the hole? in the path, and you fall right in! They should have called this game Legend of the Lemmings.
Stop! Don't go falling in that hole again. Just not move until we find a solution, okay? All right. We're gonna have to cover that hole. But with what? Oh, this is no time to be taking apart the interface, user. You can see that this character needs our help. Oh, that's uh, smart. You will probably have to unlock the amphibian skill. I'm sure it doesn't have any intel points. So, then, how are we going to get through? Those lily pads are on there by chance. Oh, I thought I saw something jump. It must have been a fish. There! I wasn't dreaming! Something definitely jumped out of the water. A chest? But where did it come from? Really? That's what I call rushing a dungeon. <laughs> Wearing a monocle underwater? Ridiculous. Anyway, now... Ah, the monocle enlarges the sprite, and the hammer shrinks them. Very interesting. These two tools are going to be very useful as we move through this world. And of course, you will be able to create chaos, as usual. Oh, the weight of the chest sank the lily pad. User, you are more talented than I thought. Good. Now we're making progress. Careful not to move too much, hero. You might fall in. And I will know who. More like a copy of Excalibur. Ah, oh, come on! Try harder! There must be some muscle underneath those pixels. Yes, keep it up! Oh, I wasn't talking to you! Unbelievable! That you're the most incompetent hero in the history of video games? If this sword isn't the sword of life, where could it be? That jar completely crushed the tip of the sword. Now there's no way we're gonna be able to cut anything with.
You've broken another interface, user. It's the legendary sword of life. Not that far away, believe me. I don't believe it. He's doing it on purpose. There's no other explanation. <laughs> 